Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Bravely Default. We're here in the Vestment Cave, just on floor one. Let's continue right where we left off. Um, I don't think we have any town updates, so let's just go ahead and continue here. Just keep going through the cave. Okay. Alright, I don't know if I showed off all the encounters last episode, so I guess we'll see now. I just have it on auto right now. Wing skills. I wonder why they... Why did they get to go... Oh, okay, now he's confused. He blizzarded himself. This is why you don't confuse Ring a Bell. He'll just frozone himself. Here. Oh, right. Actually, confused. Okay, let's keep going here. Let's go to this path first. Okay, blue chest, which I cannot get because, um, I don't know yet. I guess we'll have to figure that out, right? I don't know why I can't get those. Why, why do they get first strike again? <clears throat> I want to make sure I explore every part of every cave remedy. Okay, probably not worth that entire walk but fair enough allies get one bp okay doesn't really matter because the point here is to auto them in one turn but but I probably have some sort of system considering okay is this the stairs out of here don't give me the stairs right away of course, I find the stairs. Okay, well, I'm gonna travel back because I need to see the rest of the cave. Okay, let's this part. What is down here? Is there anything good for me? Is there Moving on here. Can I? Okay, I thought I could maybe push that boulder, but apparently not. There's two stairways down. Hmm. Also, I want to go grab that other chest. I don't feel like we're still a slightly over leveled from when we first did a couple episodes ago so let's just go grab everything and I need to see where everything leads I guess I could just follow a path and call it a day but I want to see okay let's grab this chest okay 500 pig fair enough okay inherently I just want to go to the farther staircase first and I guess if that's the main way we have to go then We'll just come back to the other staircase, right? Makes sense. Okay. This is just the chest. Okay, so yes, this farther one was the the figure. Let's see what would be better. Oh, what is this major? Reason to defense. Okay. Hmm. How would that do on the deal? Is a real question. Hmm. That would just be reasonable. Remember who's more important, the healer or the black mage? Honestly, I think I don't know what's that's what would be better, but I feel like um we're gonna probably make our use of it because the anti silence on the black mage is crazy important because wait, the leader does your job is sure to silence. Period. You can't do anything. So having that none that no silence on the idea is more important than the couple stats you receive from putting on you know what I'm saying? Okay, so I'm here. In the vestment B2. We are down at B2. And I know that screen's a little small for you guys down there, so you probably can't see it too well. Maybe I'll make it bigger for the next episodes. Chest? Echo herbs, okay. That's like 25 or 50 P get a store. Not crazy valuable, but hey, anything is anything. <clears throat> Alright, give me some better loot here. Ether. We take those 100% all day. I'll take some ethers. If I ever get in a pinch, you know, I'm gonna use them. Like I said, I think a couple episodes ago, I've been really mindful of 
actually trying to use my items in these play- You love to see it. I've been mindful to actually use my items in these playthroughs. I know a lot of people, they get their, you know, big ethers and stuff like that, and they just, you know, they're like, oh, I'll save them, I'll save them, they're, I need to use- And then you get to the final fight, it's an easy final fight, because you grind it, and then you're like, oh, well, I never got to use these items. It's like, well, I am trying to play chess while other people are playing checkers and, like, keep mindful of, use the items, you're, you know, if you finish the game without using them, it's just a right shame, so just use them. So I will. Even if it, and hey, if I use them and it makes the game slightly harder, what's well, a challenge, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Before we continue, we do have to put the difficulty of the encounter rate back up to normal. And then... Okay! We got an encounter. Ooh. I don't like that. Um, can I, can, does he sell anything good? Beast deliver. That's one of the things for raises physical attack. You know what? what about equipment? I know. So, no. It's actually aimed bad. What? What? That ain't bad at all. I'm about to stick this on everyone. Oh, I don't have enough money. Okay. Any of the- Okay, the rainbow dress ain't bad. The venture. Okay, well here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna grab two of these for now. Whoopsies, I'm clicking the wrong button. Two of these. Because that's not bad at all. Let's put one on this. The red cap. And then, how about we put one on this razor? No, I can't put the red cap, so we can't really work best. Yeah. Hmm. Maybe it would be better. Yeah, seriously, so this is better. Okay, fair enough. Okay, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, I forgot that we're doing a lot of the town stuff. Oh, let's actually check on the town while we're here. Area reclaimed. Okay. I'm gonna use my mouse now. Okay, so we have a bunch of villagers we can use here. Um. Oh, this place is still... I still need 30 minutes for this place. Fair enough. Then we'll wait out that 30 minutes. Let's use things in the meanwhile. This is three hours. Let's just make it like... Like that. This place, uh, I need to zoom out every single time. Oh, I can't get to that place yet. What about you? Ooh, more compounds? Let's get some more compounds going. Let's see. Ooh, move parts. Definitely want some move parts. S some more accessories. Let's get that. Special move shop. Let's go ahead and get that. Let's get everything working a little bit here. High potion. Ooh, those would be really nice to buy, actually. Let's get those working. Okay, let's just put all our people on that one. Okay. Cool. So we did some things. <clears throat> um, I think I'm not going to resave. If I have to redo that, that's fine. Let's just go, and he go ahead and uh, jump right into the battle. Ah, look there. Is that the rainbow thread? Oh, it's lovely! I'm shocked we actually found it here. Now, let's collect it and be quit of this place. Uh, wait, we're not alone. A monster? Let's get it. Black dragon. <clears throat> okay. You know what, let's just go ahead and default. With Adia, I don't know what this is, but... Let's just use Blizzard and maybe hope that that's Blizzard. Ooh, a special. Moonbeam. Let's just go ahead and use it for giggles. And then we're going to go ahead and use... Mm, let's just go ahead and use Arrow and see what happens. Okay, let's see. <clears throat> let's see what happens here. That's a lot of damage. Alright, you love to see it. Arrow. Oh, and I also need to put some of those power up some people. Okay, that's not as that's not that bad actually. Blizzard is the weak point. Noted. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and use Tiz as our healer for now. Go ahead and heal Adia. I'm gonna brave, 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 brave. I'm just gonna use 
lots of blizzards on him. Brave, brave, brave. Use hidden dragon, because that's super strong. And then brave, 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 brave. Use more blizzards, since he's weak to blizzards. Alright, let's go. This should do a lot of damage to him. Because even ring a bell is pretty good with black magic. I mean, it's level 1, but hey, it is what it is, right? Once we end up getting a lot of like the really strong spells, we'll, we'll get rid of that and go to something else, but... Or, you know, secondary, I'll give, give something else. Going to cure Adia, make sure she isn't close to dying or anything. Okay, that literally hits Tiz like nothing. It's absolutely nuts. Yeah, Adia does a slightly bit more damage than Ring of Bell, but obviously Ring of Bell is a white mage, not a black mage, so... That's only natural. Yeah, but we're doing a lot of damage very, very quickly. Because, again, I still think we're probably slightly overleveled, even for this dungeon. Because even a lot of the enemies are super easy still. I mean, honestly, I'm surprised this guy's not dead yet. But maybe I'm taking everything a little too lightly here. i cure everyone. Let's get a little, a little spice. Mow down. <gasps> Why did that hurt so much? Okay, well, he... Pro Good job, Tiz. He loved to see it. He protected his allies. What a what a great guy. Yeah, we're gonna cure all allies three times. Just so we can kinda get everyone out of harm's way here. As much as I at least can. Yeah, okay. Honestly, that was the first time I'm looking at the knight and I'm like, yes. That is Don't die. That is exactly why I have you here, because you're an absolute goat. And you just you just take that damage. Okay, well, we're going to do the same thing. We're just going to go ahead and uh, start spamming blizzards. The quicker we kill them, the better, you know? Saves time on the video. Saves time in-game. Get more done. I'm doing an any percent bravely to full speed run here. Okay, let's get everyone a little cured up here. Hopefully, Adia doesn't die here. I don't think she will. But, we'll see, I guess. Hopefully the dragon just dies here before we even, he even gets to attack. But that's probably not likely. Mow down. Don't kill Adia. That's... Okay. He protected another ally. Absolutely love to see it, dude. Tis is a goat. You know he is. He's out here protecting his teammates. Alright. You absolutely love to see it. You love to see it. Well, that was a surprise. No one said anything about a monster! Did the old man know about this? If he knew and didn't tell us, he's awful! That would be lying! How could he put the Vestal in danger? Without her, who would perform the rites? Be calm, Mary. Perhaps this was a trial of sorts. A test of my resolve and skill as Vestal. Regardless, we found what we came for. Let's return with the thread. Return with the thread indeed. Do I have to go grab it? Okay, it just they grabbed it themselves. Fair enough. Alright, to make this a little quicker. <clears throat> go over here to a tel teleport stone. Skyer, baby. Don't need to walk through everything. Okay, let's get out of here. And I didn't miss any of the cave, so... Okay, now we go back. We run all the way back up to his little hut. And I think we go and talk to him. And we see what he can do about that thread. Okay, when we get right here, let's go ahead and do a... Quick save -a Yes, and hopefully there's not a fight. I could probably... You know what? Oh, there's a save guy right here. Well, you know what? Let me just heal really quickly. Just in case, I don't know, we get, like, ambushed or something. I don't think we would, but... Oh. I'm out of... Cures. Fair enough. Ah, back. 
back in one piece, are you? Very impressive. Then you did know! A word of warning might have helped you, old lech! It's been so long since I set about crafting Vestal Garb, <laughs> I'd completely forgotten. I believe you were in a hurry? I'll begin straight away. All the haste in the world won't see it done before tomorrow. Make yourselves at home till then, hmm? Fair enough. <laughs> Agnes? What's the matter? Trouble sleeping? Sir, do you remember this pendant? I've treasured it like a good luck charm since I was a child. Ever since the day you gave it to me. Hmm, that brings me back. I remember it well, child. I'm pleased you've held on to it all this while. It gives me strength. In dark times, I would pray to it, talk to it, and the stone would lend me courage. Keep it close and keep it safe. Someday it may serve you better still. <sighs> and the other girl? The one who was with me when last I was here. Do you remember her? Oh, little Olivia. Yes. She serves now as the Vestal of Water. Sir, have you heard anything of her? Is she safe? The world's oceans began to fester the same day the darkness took the wind crystal. It's the crystal of water that sustains the seas. I fear. I fear the same fate has struck the Temple of Water. Or worse. I need to know if Olivia is safe, but I haven't the means or the time to seek her out. I'm afraid I know no more than you. All I can say is that she's not come to this place. I see. Tell me, child, would you care to share what else is on your mind? I'm uncertain. Until a few days ago, I lived a hermit's existence, sequestered in the temple, surrounded by acolytes. I knew nothing of the world outside, know nothing of it still. How can I be sure in the face of that ignorance? How can I know that the path I walk is the right one? Hmm. Recent years have seen the people's hearts and minds turn from the crystal orthodoxy. Its practices are all but forgotten. Yet even still, they regard the crystals and the vestals who tend them with an innate reverence. Carry out <clears throat> your duty and keep faith, my child. Therein lies the path the Vestals show to all humanity. But I... I'm still so weak. Compared to the Mother Vestal, I lack in everything. I could not stop the dark from swallowing up the crystal. I cost those women their lives. And all the world's people, kings and commoners alike, their eyes bore into me. Whether in expectation or disappointment, the weight is crushing. My shoulders are not broad enough to bear the weight of it. The hopes and fears of an army of strangers I've never so much as seen before. They frighten me. I am unfit to show them the way forward. I barely trust my legs to carry myself alone. But they have. Despite the blame and fear, you fought this far for the world and its people. 
Your fight is a noble one, just and right, and beyond any reproach. But now the time has come to set others upon that path, guide them to follow in your steps. Just as the Vestals have ever drawn upon the crystal's light to illuminate the way forward for all mankind, so must you. Words are powerful things, my child. The Vestal's words doubly so. They are a force capable of driving man to action, of sustaining him in times of need. You've walked your path for humanity's sake. Your love of this world has been your fuel. Now let your words be theirs. Share your path with them. They'll decide for themselves whether to follow or not. The world will choose as it may. But if you open your heart and point the way, you'll ignite a spark of hope within the hearts of countless men and women. Hope? You sound like Tis. Oh? Already begun lighting those sparks, have you? <laughs> You'll reach them, child. Speak, and your words will find a home. Then I had best choose them wisely. That's a good little dialogue. I knew it. You're every bit the wonder I imagined. It really suits you, Agnes. Whether it suits me or not is of little importance. These vestments are a tool, and their purpose strictly ritual. But... thank you. True! <laughs> a night's work feels like seven at my age. I thank you for your sacrifice, Sage. Your efforts will see the winds return. Oh? If you really cared to thank me, you'd plant a kiss on my cheek. Ah, oh, you're shameless. Is that another tradition surrounding the creation of the Vestal Garb? Yes. No! <laughs> It's the sad fantasy of a lecherous little toad. What? Unacceptable. Unacceptable indeed. <laughs> I do love a girl with a firm touch. Come back any time you've need of me. I'll do all I mean. <clears throat> Is this guy like old ring a bell? Is that like Is that like canon lore? Can I make it canon lore? It's like ring a bell in 80 years. Okay. Party chat. Ring a bell's reconnaissance. Just a moment, Tiz. Huh? What is it? Hmm, something's wrong? Nothing at all. This is a matter this is a matter between men, my dear. Uh-huh. Now, where was I? Ah, uh, Tiz. Last night, I chanced to awaken and notice you and Agnes were absent from your beds. What's more, you took your time coming back. Anything you'd care to confess, old chap? Just what trouble does a stick in the mud like you get up to? What? It's none of your business. Ah, uh, come on. Out with it. All of it. Every last sordid, juicy, scandalous morsel. Out. I woke up and saw she wasn't in her bed. Yeah? E then what? I got out of bed to look for her. Right, right. Sensible enough? Go on. Get to the good part. I heard a sewing machine running, so I went to the sage's workspace and found them talking. What? Talk about a turn for the boring. He listened to what was on her mind and offered her some advice. I promised myself I'd do a better job of helping her too. Ah, yes, alright. So, is that it then? That's it. 
What did you expect? We were only gone for maybe 15 minutes. And besides, what were? why were you up? <laughs> Meat or, uh, you know. Anyway, I nodded off after a few minutes of watching a day of sleep. Yeah. Alright, enough whispering. What is it, you two? Uh, nothing at all, as I said. Okay, fair enough. Let's go ahead and give it a quick save -a Save, yes. Okay, so now we have to go back to the temple if I'm if I'm correct here yes back to the temple we go should also update okay special moves oh I forgot I need to do this with my mouse okay cool um let's see I want to I want to get more special moves here yes let's just put all of them to work here okay Get on the boat. Go in the air. Well, let's get some flying done. Yeah, this game does a really good job of like not letting you in other places until you can go there. So I want to explore, but this game wasn't really made to explore like that. Can I? No. Oh, I need to land. All the way over here. I can land over here and walk. Just give me time. Party chat. Ooh. Norende's population. Hmm, the village is coming along well, but there still aren't enough people. I hear you. It would be nice to pace it up. Can't you send out a word to ask and everyone you know and ask for their help? You are everyone I know. Or right, sorry. I'm afraid the only people I know are those from the temple. No, that makes sense. Don't look at me. I'm not conscripting women into physical labor. Uh fine. I guess I'll ask my people then. I'll just oh, Right, I kind of went, I kind of went traitor, huh? Well, then we'll just have to meet some new people to enlist. Yeah, but how are we going to details? We'll just head someplace with a lot of people and trust our luck. Okay, so we don't really need to worry about that problem. Oh, we're oh, we already went to bed. Like, oh, we we did sleep at that old man's house, right? I forgot about that. Okay, well, we don't need anything else, and we can just save on the world map. So let's just go ahead and get out of here. And we head to the Wind Temple. Okay, let's go inside. And luckily, we opened up a little shortcut area here. And now we have to go inside. But I will end the episode off here, guys. If you did enjoy, make sure to like and comment as supports my channel. And I'll see you guys later. God bless, and goodbye.